Hi, in this video, I'm going to help you to shorten your data consolidation at least by 30%, right? If this situation sounds familiar, let's learn. Well, we have files right in the folders and uh, the request is that they want to get the third row's value of the quantity. So in this case, right, it means that they want this value. 90 row, right? But that's the only one. But for every single file, right, they want the third row, always the third row. So let's begin, right? Let's close this file, right? I have done this earlier, right? Let's go for another one. So first, we head to data, get and transform, get and forms, and look at from folder, from folder. And click on browse and uh, we'll look for the file call um, just for any folders right and just click OK and we click transform and we want to need the cost the binary columns right so right click and choose the uh, remove uh, where it called that remove others column right okay so right click remove others column then after that we go to add columns and you choose a custom column now over here we type in the Excel workbook and double click on this content Here we just put this data, right? Or maybe just get, get Excel data and click OK. So, this column name you can write anything you like. Excel.wordbooks, same. And make sure it's in capital letters, right? Case sensitive. Click OK. So, we have this table. Not big much yet, right? But let's just delete this. Click on this button. Uncheck use original column. This is the original column. We don't need that. So have everything. Click OK. And now we have a table right there, right? And we don't need this, we don't need that, right? So what we could do is that. Okay. So we can just right click on the this and choose remove others column. So one table is from 2017 and the other column is from 2018, right? But now we want to promote these row to the top, right? For each of this table. Each row represent the table, each row, right? So for each table, promote it. Go to custom pro column and over here, we choose table dot promote header click on this right close it and then we have the uh, promote my header click OK Ooh, look at that right we didn't get it right so let's head over to here right um, so you can always type power query right it's table dot promote Headers, right, with the S there as well. So let's come back here. Headers. So as you can see, right, it's very specific, right? So now we have the table the headers, right? You see the the headers now promoted to one right, above, right? Compared to this. Then we want something from the uh I can get the first row and get the columns, right? And for this, I will choose the first one, right? So how do you get the first one, right? Custom column. We're here, type table dot first. Give them the table. Right, this column contains the table elements in each row. And here, first line, I just say that. I click OK. Now I have a record that represents the first line of each table. The first line of each table. So now, I'm going to turn this record into a table. How to do that? Well, uh, there is a table uh, 
functional record dot to lease so we're going to use that okay so I'm going to do this record dot to lease and in the data there right, it has to be a record and then click OK right so now I have a lease you can see that right here if I want to get a first item right I'll just use lease dot first right so click custom lease dot first right I want to get something from the first one first item click OK so there I extracted in this list I extract the first item the same goes to these right I have the first item so in this video I show you how to get the first line item right from the table get a first line into a record and turn the record into a lease and from there I use the list offers to get a first item and um, in my next video I'll show you how to get the third items in the the third so the the third row right just like what I share with you here right? is the third rows value of the quantity value okay so thanks for watching right and uh, remember believe in yourself you're amazing thank you